guys and welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time joining us, Karibu Sana. Please don't forget to smash the subscribe button. Do what? Smash the subscribe button and hit the notification bell right beside that every time I have a simple recipe, you are instantly notified on the same. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how I make this delicious Indomie and egg recipe. Let's get cooking. My ingredients today of making my indomie and egg, I'll need three pieces of egg right here. I'll need some cubed uh, tomatoes, diced tomatoes. I need some bell peppers colored. I'm using the green one and the red one. I also need some stripes of these bell peppers just to garnish this. I have the, the sauce, the indomie sauce, the slice which come with the noodles. Then I have my salt. I have my dania. I have my noodles here just to search it, sorry enough. And in my pan, I have my cooking oil and my red onion sliced. So my red onion is starting to cook. Uh, we're going to let this uh, to cook until it is starting to turn brown. Then we'll add in our bell peppers. So my onion has started to brown. I'm going in with my bell peppers. We're going to leave away the stripes. Remember this is for garnishing. So add those which are diced. Mm -hmm. The aroma of the bell peppers frying is just amazing. So just going to fry this for about two minutes. So now our onions and bell peppers are perfectly done. We are going to add in our tomatoes. You can also blend them. So we are going to cook until the tomatoes have released all their juices. So the tomatoes are perfectly done. Our next step is adding the spices that come with our noodles, the bumbu sauce. So I'll add the two bumbu sauce. And then I'll only add one chili. So that is okay. We're going to bring this to a wood stir. The next thing, we're going in with two cups of water. So remember, this is just to cook our noodles. So we're going to let this come to a boil. Then we will add in our noodles. I have not forgotten about our eggs. Now what you're going to do to our eggs, we're going in with our dania. So add all of them. And I'm going to add in a quarter teaspoon of salt. And then we're going to whisk this until it is foamy. Our water had boiled, so I've just added in my indomie. In the meantime, we're going to be whisking our eggs. So whisk your eggs until they are foamy so that they will be your egg and the uh, indomie is going to be fluffy. Perfect. So our indomie is continue to cook and everything is going on well. So we are going to uh, wait for the indomie to cook perfectly until uh, when the water has gone down. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to cover this with this lid. And it's going to sink in, but there's no problem. And then let them cook for about two to three minutes. My indomie are perfectly cooked. And now we are going in with our well beaten egg. So, just pour it on top. And we're just gonna make sure that every indomie is covered by the egg just like that and then now we are going to lower our heat to low and then we're going to cover this and let it cook for about uh, three to five minutes 
wow my indomie and egg are doing great and now i'm going in with my peppers remember the one that i said it is just to garnish so i'm just going to place them at the middle just like that the last one there you go so you see the edges I see the egg has started to to cook so this means even our indomie are becoming incorporated with the egg and that is exactly what we want so we're going to let this continue cooking remember it was three to five minutes I've just added my bell peppers so let this let this be covered for the next like two minutes so my indomie and egg is almost done so one secret uh, so that your indomie and egg will come out perfectly you need to be shifting um, the place of heat slowly by slowly so once it stays there like for 30 seconds you again shift uh, to this side so also this side can cook and remember all this while your indomie and egg is covered okay so this is because we're not baking in an oven but while it is in an oven then work will be way way easier so now i'm done making my indomie and now it's time to serve so guys i am done making my indomie and egg you see it's look like a pizza so if you can't afford a pizza worry not because you can use the indomie and eggs at home and make your own this is super delicious. I promise you, you won't be disappointed. Uh, the way it came to the pot, I uh, remember the way I slided the egg in the omelette uh, recipe. Please check out in the description box. I just slid the same, my egg, indomie and egg, to my plate. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, don't forget to share, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't, because I've just given you a better reason to be my subscriber. Bye-bye!